What's up, YouTube? It's Jose, your Volkswagen aficionado, back with another video. This one in particular is just going to be a video on how to see the different options on your camera system. This one being an SEL Premium, you have the area view. So you have your four different cameras and there's sensors all around the car. Nevertheless, let's get right into it. So to pull it up manually, you're just going to hit this button right here. And then it's going to default to your park assist feature, which is the feature that parks the car by itself for you. I have a separate video on that as well, if you'd like to know how to operate that. But for this video, we're just going to see the cameras and the sensors. So you turn that on, turn off the park assist. Then it's going to default to your front camera and it's going to default to the widest view. Right. But if you're in this view, whether it's in the front camera or the backup camera, when you turn the steering wheel, the yellow lines are your trajectory lines. It'll show you exactly where the car is going to go, right? In whatever direction. The green lines are always going to be fixed. But now, new for 2024, if you turn the wheel, it's going to turn the camera, essentially. It's not physically turning the camera, but it's just giving you that extra, more wide view, which is very cool. See? So that's awesome. So like I said, same thing for the front and for the back. So let's go to the backup camera. Like I said, it's going to default already to the widest view. But if you throw the car in reverse, it's going to default to this view. And then if you turn the wheel, see, gives you that wider view that you need. So this view right here, I'm not sure why it's not popping up right now. So we have to see maybe it needs to restart but this view is for your trailer hitch so if you have a trailer hitch equipped with any atlas it's going to give you this view where it has a line here and wherever you have the wheel turned it'll show you where it's going to line up with the hitch so that way you can get a perfect lineup if you're towing something that way you don't have to keep going back and forth trying to line it up perfectly you'll get it right the first time so you see it here it's a yellow line that turns with the steering wheel that way you know exactly where you're going if you hit one of the side cameras, it's gonna show you both sides. And then that yellow line is basically showing you how far out the wheel will go. So right now you see I turned the wheel all the way to the left and that's how far out it's gonna go. So that way you don't hit any curbs or anything and scratch your wheels and whatnot. Right here also, I don't know if you can notice it here, this gray line, that's picking up on the car that's right behind us. That's the sensors. When you're actively in gear, it'll change color. So. The closer you get, it's gonna it's gonna go from yellow to red. But right now, because we pull it up manually, it just shows you where it's at, not in color. And then, yep. And then this is your top-down view as well. So you can look at this view, and that way you can you can also see if you're in the parking spot, you know, straight. If you need to even out a little bit more, things like that. So yep, it's a very useful feature. So that right there is called area view. Like I said earlier, for the park assist, which is this right here, I have a separate video on it. It'll park the vehicle by itself in whatever parking space. Nevertheless, thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Continue to support. I appreciate every single one of you and stay tuned for more.